morning everybody and welcome to excel made easy well this is your excel guru today with a formula called average uh, average in excel allows you to find the arithmetic mean of a given range of cells now i'll be taking you further deep into it and now i would like to say say for example uh, this is zones say Delhi, Indore, Bangalore, Madras, Patna, Bhopal, Mathura, Kanpur, Noida and these are the units sold of a, of a specific product in that, in that zone and these are the amounts of correlating to the sale units so see if you want to find out what was the average units sold per zone what was the average collection amount sale amount per zone so that is what I'll tell you in this formula that is what average will assist you to find and I'll be teaching you this formula uh, explaining this formula to you rather in two ways one is my most favorite way by entering the formula syntax into a cell the other way is by going into the data tab and using the FX feature I'll be covering both of them so let's start with my favorite one which is the formula syntax so every formula in Excel starts with uh, is equal to sign a few people start with plus sign also so you type in is equal to then you type in average you see these formula uh, all these annotations below average a average if average if all these formulas would be taught by me I'll be explaining each and every formula to you now in Excel 2007 it gives you a wonderful option to if you if you are typing in some formula name and it appears below and if you find that's right just press tab and it will come up automatically and a parenthesis sign or a bracket open sign would, would also appear automatically that is what I did now we need to choose the range for which we need to find the average now before going to what is a range uh, we'll have to understand what is a cell now Excel works on cells and ranges references see if we click over here you see uh, here is the cell address it is D 17 that means D is the column and 17 is the row so this is the cell now if I press shift and use my upward arrow key I would be able to select a range now a collection of cells is called a range now I've selected my range I'll press shift and parenthesis close bracket close I'll press enter and this is the average you see and we were able to get the average now we need to say we need to increase the font size and see this is the average wasn't it easy it's the mathematical mean of this complete range now another way to do it is we go to data tab in this ribbon then sorry we go to formulas we go to FX feature alright and then over here search for a function we type in the name of a function that we would like to search or execute we'll type in average so go once we click on go everything related with average would come up over here as I said I'll be teaching all these formulas a few of them have already been taught by me so I'll click over here see what does it say return the average arithmetic mean of its arguments which can be numbers or names arrays or references that contain numbers now it has selected the range E9 to E17 see we can also do it it has done it automatically we will do it we will do it ourselves we'll select this range alright and we'll click on OK and this is our average for this see this is the average of this amount if you see this formula for our sales amount and the formula for sales unit is the same though we did them by two different ways one this was done by entering the formula syntax yes you remember and this was done by using the formula tab 
factor this is it uh, for this uh, average however this file that you see uh, that you are watching right now is available on YouTube and this Excel file is available on my website excelmadeeasy.weebly.com now you can go to that website and download this file for free yes this is my website Excel made easy here's the syntax and you can download this file for free here is my playlist you can click and if you this is the English playlist is the Hindi list and once you go over here click on this icon would take you directly to my YouTube channel here training index and trains you click over here and it would take you to my downloadable files channel on my video store, you can watch them at your convenience by downloading the file. You can play along, follow along, or practice later. Along with that, I'm also subscribe to my whenever there is, you will be automatically made aware of. One thing I'll call if you like doing, do, do provide feedback on my social links. The best way by clicking on this link, it would allow you to like me and part of your feedback. Much more. We want you to comment here. Well, this was running all day. Happy learning.